Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Unlock Part 2. Today, we're still at the Noise Side Show. Um, this is Part 2 of this whole, like, escape game of the Noise Side Show. And right now, I'm going back to where I left off. So, what I discovered is that if you pay very close attention, I can see a 2, I can see a 6, and I also see a plus there, but I also see a 1. So, this is where it gets a little bit confusing. So, so in my calculations, it may be uh, 63. Maybe 63. Because there's no way to get a hint from the app that has the letter Z. So let's get 63 there. Here it is. And we gotta place it right over here. There we go. Let's see. Yep. And this is where it gets a little bit interesting, because we have these numbers, these two numbers that were like half and half. So it says, from now on, our circus clown Piro, Augustus, Michael, appears. And I think we're supposed to put these together. Oh no. We're supposed to put these together to make a certain number. So, so, this is like 62, and if I get, and there's a 5 here, let's see, let's see, so I think the answer is 34, 62. Could be 3462 that we're looking for. So let's go ahead and search that. Here's 34. And here's 62. So let's hope I'm right. Yep, I was right. So over here we have, it's a ring, my treasure. Another puzzle that we cannot solve, so we need to figure out where to put that, and we have this clown, but something isn't right. He looks sad, while this one right here is supposed to be happy. So, what is happening to the clown Piro? Well, apparently, according to this um, program, it says his specialty, press the flower three times, then and the red nose once. So, that means... That means that I have to go to the app, and it makes me start over because I, my phone keeps, like, slowing down whenever I use it for, like, either watching videos and stuff. Anyways, I'm going to go to 62, and it shows him feeling sad. He seems so sad, he forgot to take his red nose, and I think what I'm supposed to do is that I am supposed to go to 72 to solve this clue. Because if you go to the clown's uh, compartment or something, it says you find the clown's red nose among this jumble. The show can go on. Now I gotta go back to 62. And the clown is happy. The clown is very happy. So now, the next thing that I need to do is to follow these instructions according to the program. So I have to press the flower three times. And then, press the red nose only once. And there's water splatter everywhere. And, you may not be able to see it, but according to this app, it says 58. So... That means that I have to go and get a card 58. I, I play a little bit of this before, 
because I was attempting to record this and now it's like put this side here flip this over and we got another one of these we got another one of these um hold on we got another one of these ring stage things okay and I think let's see if we move this away and let's read what it says first. It says, Ha, ah, that's so funny. What a funny man you are. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Meeker. So from now on, with a big round of applause, welcome our acrobatic monkey, monkey Sims family. <laughs> and right over here we have um, a four. So, what I can gather is that this goes like this goes like this. It's supposed to go like this, but I gotta get it closer and closer until it forms a number. And it's supposed to be like this. So I can assume um, I have to go to 42, card 42. I pay very close attention. Here's card 42. See if I'm right. Yes, I am. All right. So what we have here, we have the monkeys. And I gotta discard this card. So let's flip it over, rotate. And then put it in the discard pile, which is up here. And then we're going to place the monkeys here. Now this one right here is a little bit tricky because, because what it says right here is to form a pyramid on top of a horse. Can't miss their colorful performance, which I'm assuming you have to look at the card in order to figure things out. So, we got three bananas, and we got six monkeys, and one horse, of course. So, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. But I don't know if that's right. However, from what I can gather, if you pay attention to the horseshoes, it'll, it'll be like one, two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I'm guessing we're looking for the number ten, but the only problem is, the only problem is right now is that that is not the number because this is the number where we got this when we look at the neon sign. Unless you can count this card. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Let's see. This is kind of like a tricky one. This is kind of a tricky one. Have to pay very close attention because we may never know if this is the right one. This is uh, another thing that I need to think about because it's like, oh my goodness, I don't know if I'm going to get this right. I don't want to get it wrong. So, hold on for a second. Alright, so I have to use a hint for this one. It says the path of acrobats took is important. Draw it to, draw it on the ring. Which is, of course is the circus ring, which I am correct. Then I need to take another hint. Follow the path of the acrobats and you will see a letter. Take the corresponding card. Hmm. Wait a minute. I think now I see what it's talking about. So the ring is in a circle and 
the horseshoes has some sort of like line in it. So we're look we're actually looking for the cue card. This is where I probably messed up um, when when I attempt to record this. Let's see, am I right? Oh yes, I am. Look at this. What is going on here? The acrobat left the stage with a loud applause. Mr. Loyal has his back on you. What is he waiting for? Hmm. He has his back on you. Oh! Oh! So you look at the back of a card, and it's supposed to form a number. So, this one is supposed to be 2782. I don't know if that's correct. So here's the card 27. And here's card 82. Which I may be wrong. Nope, I was right. Alright. So it didn't say anything about this card anything. So... Let's go ahead, and we got, we got this guy here, which contains another puzzle, but it's red. Uh, it says, aiming at the target, but who took my knife? Can you go near the car and check it out? And this one right here is just says, five points if you hit the fly, which is right over here. Let's see here. Let's see. I think we're supposed to go to the aquarium. 72. And let's see here. The, I went to the clown cart and it says there's nothing left to do here. The clown went to the feed to feed the fish. So that means I get to go to the aquarium. What a magnificent aquarium. So this is where I take card 22. Let's go click right to search. Here's card 22. Alright. And this is where I'm having a very extreme hard time. Let's rotate. Put it right here. And let's see what it says here. It says, Aquarium number 22. Inside lives a family of Sawfish Dylan, Hammerhead Ashley, and the famous Sturgeon Brandon. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. But they also have these puzzle pieces that contains, uh, that contains like a fish soul. And I think the, the number plus 18 one, we need to get these fish. But the only main issue right now is that... The main issue right now is that I need something so that it can keep still and make it look like an actual knife. Which is exactly what he needs. And I just discovered that there is a 30, number 30, which means I have to take a num number 30 card. I have a feeling that this is a banana peel. Still gotta pay attention though. Come on. Ah, there it is. Number 30. See what this is. And this is another puzzle. It says the acrobat monkeys monkey left this behind. Fortunately, you found it and picked it up with your hand. What kind of trash is this? In which trash can should I throw it away? Hmm. Maybe it has something to do with this. Yeah. If we put these together, that could definitely help. So, we need to add it together. So, that leads to 6 and 4. So, it's got to be 46, right? It's got to be 46. Because of that three there. 
Yep, we got the 46 card, and let's see what it is. Yes, it is absolutely correct. So now I get to discard number 30, number 16, number 29 because I completed his objective, and lastly, number 10, which is finally gotten rid of. I got, and I got to rotate it like this. All right. So what is left to do is to put it on a discard pile, just like that. And voila. Voila. And we have another puzzle right here, which we need to solve. But I have a feeling I might have solved it. So let's see if we could try this. So, so let me... Hold on. Keep messing up. Let's see. Six, seven, eight. Um, six, seven, eight. Um, five, six. Six, seven, eight. Five, six. Hmm. Hold on. Something isn't adding up. Sixty-eight. Which I know it's not right because I discarded. So it's got to be this one right here. So 46, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So that's a 4. Carry the 1. That leads to 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So could it be 64? It'd be 64. Because I have to calculate the numbers with this. And I was right. Ooh, that was a close one. Alright, so I managed to solve that. And I have to solve the others. So 46. Let me see here. The refrigerator is working again. Yeah. Um, Brandon's family stopped moving. Maybe it's because of fear, or maybe it's because it's too cold. Oh, so they're freezing, turning turning them into knives. So I have to discard this card here. And there we go. Alright, so now I think we gotta put these together. We gotta put these together. Because it has a puzzle there. So 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So that's a 1. Uh, 7, 8, 9. So we have to get a 91 card. Let's see what's on the 91 card. And I have to pay very close attention to these numbers of cards here. Here's a 91. And I was right. And it also has that symbol. So, let's see. Don't worry. No animals were injured during the performance. So, let's see what this guy does. I can't pronounce his name. His sharp, vo his sharp knife and dangerous moves makes your body tremble. So, this goes over here. So, let's see. So now I gotta figure out how to solve this uh, 82 one. It says five points if you hit the fly. Hmm. So this one has only one point right here. It can't be 51. Because that would be too obvious. Plus, I might get this wrong. So I'm going to use a hint to figure this out. Uh, each color circle has a value going from 1 to 5. It will be used when the, kni when the knives will be thrown. I wonder if we also have to check this image as well. 
So these two cost one, two, the black ones, three is blue, the four is red, and the orange ones cost, gives you five points. Five points. And I wonder if you pay attention to the image right here, does it help as well? So two points because he landed on the white. And for the blue ones, that's like three points. So four, five. Hold on. Let's see. Two. And this is two points, so that makes it four. Uh, three points is like five, six, seven. And this one right here, which is cost five points, will be eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So this leads to a question. Are we looking for a number twelve card? If it's in there, yes it is, but I don't know if it's the right one. I'm kind of nervous right now. I am kind of nervous right now. Oh my goodness! It looks like I was right. The number 12 is the right answer because of these uh, images, if you pay close attention to these cards here. So, I get to discard... Uh, number 82 and Q. So, it looks like Q goes here, and 82 is now gone. So now we have another puzzle that we need to solve. And this one says, uh, Vidolus, I can't pronounce the name left the stage. Suddenly, someone in the audience burst into tears. My balloon! It's so high up! Who should I ask for help? Let's see. Something to do with this puzzle that I cannot figure out. It cannot be the rings. I don't know if it's the fence, though. This is where it gets a little bit tricky. So, I'm going to have to use a hint on this one. And it says, there is a circus artist who is in the habit of climbing high, find her trailer. Oh, so, that means I have to go back to the machine and go to number 72. And I think it's the girl with the flaming thing. Responding to your cry for help, the trapeze, trapeze uh, artist hurries to the top, to the big top. So this is plus 47 if we put together this puzzle. Do we have to go to number 47? I don't think so. Let's see. I don't want to get this wrong. I'm trying to make sure if there's a 47 card. But apparently it is not. Apparently it is not. So I think I have to put it together with this... Um, because I am using the app. So, 47. 8, 9, with, uh, let's see, 2 plus 7, that equals 9. And then that equals, and then 1 plus 4 equals 5. So that equals 59. And what a coincidence. We have this card. We have the 59 card. Let's see. And I was right. I was definitely right. Okay, so now I get to discard the number 12. That's gone. And also just a reminder that this is a non-time limit um, game playthrough. 
And the reason for that is because I'm not very good at hurry things up, you know? Because I always, like, get everything messed up and all. Alright, so. After saving the balloon, the swing artist is trying to light a match and burn the tent. Uh-oh. Um, let's check out what the artist does. Smoke a match. This artist will sweep the whole stage. Hmm. And this one has a minus in. In the back, the, it has a minus uh, four. I wonder what that means. And I wonder if I'm supposed to... No, nah, because it has to have the circle thing. This is kind of like a tricky um, situation, but as you can tell, she has another gear, so I gotta go ahead to the machine to go to 59. And you can't see it, but there's an animation of the girl swinging, and I have to pay very close attention because it leads to a number. Okay, so the number is 1 and 8. So... That means that I have to go to card 18. I have to search for card 18. Come on. There it is. Card 18. Is that correct? I guess it was. Okay, so this one right here, it says, The trapeze artist quickly finished the performance. Mr. Loyal appeared behind you again and said, What a shooting star! Now let's have the next performer. And I think the next performer has got to be the magician. So, let's see here. Okay. And we and we also need to figure out the other stuff as well. So let's go to eighteen. I'm going to use a hint. What if you literally look for the num the next number? So I have to pay very close attention to the image itself. I was doing very good without hints up until I have to use one and, and the other one to solve the solution. Uh, the number of this card, which is 18, so the next number is 19, which makes it way too obvious. Alright, so number 19 it is. I cannot see it in the image, but let's go there. And we have to be very careful not to let it pass us. There we go. Time for number 19. And what is this? What is this here? And we have to discard 18. No, no, no. Not rotate. Oh, this is not what I asked for. I'm trying to rotate, and it's just, and I accidentally pressed something in the keyboard. Okay, let's see what it says here. It says, the magician Pedro tries to cut his assistant to, to pieces. Wait a minute, where's my saw? Ah, oh, so this requires a fishing saw. This requires a fishing saw, but the problem is, will it work? So, I think we can solve this as, as easy, but will it be very simple as it sounds? 
because it is a fish and it could probably move. So, 1957, so 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, so that's number 6, carry the 1, so 1 plus 1 equals 2, plus 5 equals 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then we go backwards, 6, 7. So we're looking for 70, I, I forgot, so 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 76. Let's search on that. Here it is. Oh! Let's see. And there's another puzzle that we need to solve. 76. And this one says, Fish are, are very good at tricking. You have a hold in your hand. So that means I gotta discard. I gotta discard uh, twenty-two. But what about the hammer dude? What about the hammer fish? Apparently, the shark hammer is way too big, so it's not gonna go anywhere according to the hints. I gotta make sure of that. So I guess that means that we finish with this card, and now. We got to figure out how to deal with this. I think this goes here. I think it goes here. Because we are... Because we are, like, um... Trying to... Do this magic trick. Let's see. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So that's a 5. Carry the 1. So, 1 plus 7. First off, that equals 8, plus 1 equals 9, so we're looking for 95? Is that the answer? Let's find out. If there's a 95 card. No, that's not it. It's not 95, because there's no 95 card. Let's see. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, five. Carry the one. One plus one equals two. Plus seven that equals three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hmm. Something isn't adding up here. Something is not adding up here. I don't know if this is um, the way to do this. So we probably need something. So let's go ahead and use a hint for 76. And it says make sure to place the card at edge. Um, place the card edge to the, um, to the dot of the line and find a number on either side. Ah. Oh. Let's see here. Hmm. Oh, I think I see now. But I'm going to have to stop from here because this may take a little bit of a while to figure things out. But I think I might have an idea of what it's telling me, but that's all for today's video. Stay tuned for part three, and until then, stay safe and have a wonderful day.